guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited to share with you my Target Christmas clearance haul. Yay, I know, it has been literally forever since I've sat down and filmed a bunch of haul videos. So this is so great, and I'm so excited to share with you guys a bunch of my goodies that I picked up this year. Basically, I went shopping at my Target stores and I kind of shopped their Christmas clearance area and even like a couple of the other random little areas. Um, and I picked up a few things. I definitely did not go crazy like I have in the past, but I still feel like I picked up a good, conservative, decent amount of goodies to share with you. So anyway, yeah. So with that said, I think it is now time to get into my Target Christmas clearance decor haul video. So I'm going to kind of start with like the non Christmassy items that I picked up on clearance. And this first item is the cute little lid stuff eyeshadow palette from Soap and Glory that was at Target. I was so excited to find this. I did get some other Soap and Glory stuff for Christmas, but I was really excited to find this little eyeshadow palette. So I got this for half off. So 50% off. It was originally $9.99. I paid $4.99 for this. So again, five bucks. Um, and there are six shades in here and they thought I thought they were just so pretty. This is just what they look like. They're really fun, kind of pinky, rosy, mauve-ish, well, kind of. That's a very awful explanation. But anyway, yeah, that's just what they look like. And I did pick up two of these, one for myself and then one for a future giveaway. So I thought that was a really good deal for only $4.99. So yeah, I was really excited to find this. They had a bunch of like Soap and Glory stuff on sale, but this is all I decided to pick up. So this next item was definitely with all of the kid stuff, but it was originally $5. And for 90% off, I only paid 50 cents for these. And it's just a set of three scrunchies from the brand Cat and Jack. And they just call them hair ties. It's a three pack. So I've got this really beautiful red color. That's more true to color right there. If I put it up a little closer, it looks a little too red, but back here is definitely a nice dark deep red. And then of course a beautiful white shade. This will go with so many things. And then this one will also go with a lot of my stuff too. It's this really fun kind of like Tiffany blue, tealish color, more of like a sea foam ish greenish color. Um, but I thought they were really fun. So again, they're just scrunchies. You don't have to use them just for kids. I thought they were great. And also these would be like so cute on your wrist. Like, how cute is that? Oh, it's so fun. Anyway, again, 50 cents, such a good deal. So this next item I'm really excited for because I definitely did not see this in stores before Christmas, but I got this for 90% off clearance. Um, so it was originally $3 and I only paid 30 cents for this thing. It is so cute. It's this really beautiful pink and Tiffany blue unicorn bag charm poof ball. How adorable is this? Like seriously, so cute. Oh, I just thought it was so adorable. I think that they had a couple other different design, like different like little characters and designs and whatnot. But of course, you know, I'm going to go with the unicorn and of course, course it's going to be my two favorite colors put together so I thought it was fun it doesn't really give a brand or anything it just says keychain one piece but um yeah for 30 cents um this was coming home with me for sure so this next item is definitely the dumbest item of all of the items <laughs> that I picked up but this was originally eight dollars and 90 percent off clearance that made it only 80 cents so I was actually really excited to find this but basically they just call this the 30 watt that's like the brand of this and it's the holiday party two-piece set and it's the Santa hair and beard set. So basically it just looks like that. I have the Santa hair wig and the whole beard. So um, yeah, it was only 80 cents. And with me doing my acting stuff and wanting to write things and film things and stuff, I thought this would be fun just because it does kind of look like that, like typical cheesy, cheapy Santa stuff. And I thought it'd be kind of fun if I ever needed like a Santa imposter um, or anything like that, just because again, it does look absolutely ridiculous. But um, anyway, I was still really excited to find it. It was only 80 cents. It does not look like a good traditional Santa. This is definitely for gags and giggles. And um, yeah, I don't know. I thought it was great for only 80 cents. So brand new in package. I mean, it's kind of falling apart at this point, but that's okay. I can tell it's literally never been touched. And for 80 cents, I thought, why not? put it in my costume bin um because i'm sure i'm going to need it one day honestly it's not out of the realm of possibilities <laughs> so these next items i was so excited to find so basically i found these again for 90 percent off such a good deal they were originally four dollars i paid 40 cents for these so 80 cents total for the two of them this would have cost me eight bucks eight bucks that's almost ten dollars i paid not even a dollar almost a dollar anyway 80 cents. <laughs> so I found two of these. These are the sugar paper tissue paper sets. I thought this was so awesome. So this first one just looks like this. It's all white right here and the scallops really, really fun. And then this little scallopy one is all white with gold foiled stars. And then this one is all white with the scallops and then gold foil polka dots. So I thought they were so cute. 40 cents. I was so excited to find these. Um, I don't know how many sheets are in here. Oh, 25 sheets. It says right on the front. 25 
sheets in each pack. So I found one of this set and then I found this beautiful set. So basically it's the exact same as the other set. They're all scallopy. This one again, white with gold polka dots, white with gold foil stars. And then this one is a beautiful blush color. It is so pretty. I just love this so much. So again, really excited to find the two of these little tissue paper sets. Um, so for uh, 50 sheets of tissue for 80 cents for me. Super excited. So cute. I love the scallops. I love the colors. I love everything about it. Love sugar paper. Love it all. Love everything at Target. But um, yes, I thought they were cute. It's such a good deal. So excited to find those. So let's keep going on the little sugar paper trend here. This next item, I know I got this for 90% off because again, it was the day I found it, the tissue paper. Um, this was originally $5. So I paid 50 cents for this. And there are 15 tags in this little set. So this is just what it looks like. They're fun. Again, these look like they are all white and they just say to and from in gold metallic like lettering if you guys can see kind of under there under that like little papery tag thing and then this one just has polka dots all the way around it and then this one has gold stars all the way around it so I thought that was so cute oh so fun so yes again there's like five of each little design three different designs so I thought that was great oh love sugar paper so I do have two other items from sugar paper and then we'll keep going on to like other things that are not gifty giving type items <laughs> So again, my last sugar paper items, I got these for 70% off. So they were originally $6, which made them $1.80 each, which again, is still such a good deal. This would have cost me $12 and I paid literally less than four. So there's that. That's crazy. $3.60 or whatever. So anyway, I was so excited to find these. The first one that looks like this, it's just a spool of the ribbon and it's just solid gold, like shimmery gold. I don't know if I can like, I can't get that off, but anyway, oh wait. Oh, there we go. Whoops. Well, now I just released it. Anyway, it's just gold, gold, shimmery, glittery. I thought it was really, really cute. Again, and these are the large rolls too. They're not the little tiny baby ones. I'll leave the plastic on on this one. But again, it is all white with a gold glittery, like little shimmery trim here and here. And I don't think that these... I don't think that this is wired. I think it's just regular ribbon. But again, I was so excited to find these for only $1.80. That is such an amazing deal. So again, this would have cost me $12 for the two of these had I bought them before Christmas. And I only paid $3.60. That is insane, literally insanity. But again, I love them. I'm so excited to find these. I know I picked up some other ones last year. I think I had a couple pink ones and a couple white ones. Um, but I only found two this year and I was totally happy and content with that. So again, sugar paper, 70% off, $1.00. 80 each oh my gosh hallelujah so that is basically it for all of these small kind of gift giving type items and other like random little miscellaneous things next we're going to get into core this is like where all of the big kind of stuff is i'll kind of gradually move up in size um we'll do the small ones first even though they do pack a punch um and then we'll move into the large ones after that so okay anyway let me just keep rolling with this video so these next items i was so excited to find because they are so gosh darn adorable basically they were originally 9.99 each and i got them for seven person off which made them $2.99 each such a good deal I could not pass them up I could not leave them at the store even though I really don't need it I will say that all of these other items yes absolutely this one hmm, kind of kind of on the edge there but again I could not pass them up anyway I found two of the project 62 bottle openers and look at how cute this bottle opener is oh my lanta it is the cutest thing it is a gold nutcracker it is so cute again I picked up two basically what I'm going to do with these I'm going to keep this one because the box is all busted and then this one I'm going to put in a giveaway next Christmas or this Christmas in like, I don't know, 10, 11 months, something like that. Um, but I just thought it was such a good deal. Like, honestly, how cute is this? Oh, so adorable. I just thought it was so cute. They're super heavy duty. Um, at least they feel like they are. And for only $2.99, um, yes, hello. I would have been a fool to pass them up. Um, but yeah, this is just what it looks like outside of the actual packaging. And again, I don't drink or anything like that, so that's why I'm kind of saying it's kind of a useless item for me. But if I were to ever have friends over or some kind of a Christmas gathering and somebody did bring something, I don't even know, is apple cider, like, do you need a bottle opener for apple cider? I don't know. Maybe, maybe one day I'll need one. I don't know. Um, I think I do have one other bottle opener and it's a flamingo. So I couldn't really bust out a flamingo at Christmas time. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, this is why I decided to pick this up. And also because it was just really cute and a really good deal. So I thought it was cute. Um, yeah, love the little nutcracker and it's all gold. So again, like I said, if I have a party, I'm going to have to put out something like this and why not have a cute Christmassy nutcracker that I only had to pay $2.99 for. <sighs> 
So cute. Yes, love it. So cute. Again, Project 62. I didn't even know that they were already clearancing this brand. I'm like, did y'all not just get this in the stores? Like, honestly, you had it for like a month and then you guys clearanced it to 70% off. So I don't care. I'll take it. Thanks, Target. <laughs> so with that said, that is that. Let's keep going. So this next item I was super excited to find. Basically, it was only originally $3, which again, is not really like a bad price to begin with. Um, but I got it on 90% off. So I only had to pay 30 cents. 30 cents. That was such a weird way to say 30 cents. Anyway, this is what it looks like. It's a little mug. I don't know what's going on there, but that's okay. Um, yes, it's this really cute little tiny reindeer mug. So adorable. He's got a cute little red scarf on, which the plaid is kind of crooked, which kind of bothers me, but like only mildly bothers me. Um, but his face is cute. So that's like all that really matters. Um, and he is pretty tiny. So if you don't want to use this for a mug, you could certainly put a tree in here and it'd be really, really cute. Um, and just kind of use him as like an actual decor piece rather than like an actual working mug. Um, that's in your cycle of mugs. So, um, yeah. Anyway, with that said, that's it. Uh, just threshold brand, nothing super specific or anything like that. Again, super cute. I love him. And he was not broken. So that was actually a really good sign. <laughs> so yeah, 30 cents, ladies and gentlemen, 30 cents. So this next item actually did not have a price and I wish there would have been more, but I'm okay with just one. Um, and this didn't even have a price tag on it. So our cashier had to look up like trees or I don't even know what she looked up basically she came up with the price she asked me if it was okay I said uh-huh um so whatever it was so I guess if it was 50 cents then 90% off means it would have been five dollars to begin with but if you guys bought any of these let me know because I would be curious to know if whatever she gave me was like I don't know. I don't know if it was anywhere near close to what the actual price was, but basically this is just what it looks like. It's a like white Christmas tree on this little wooden stand and it's like pretty glittery. You can tell some of the glitter is like falling off, but again, in transit and uh, through the crazy holiday rush, I understand, but it's really cute. It's kind of a very weird material, but I like it. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. It's different. Um, and it's kind of like a furry material. I don't really know what I would call this, but this is like my little fir tree. It's odd, but I like it. <laughs> so again, let me know if these were originally $5 or not. I have no clue and I'm literally combing it with my nails. That's disgusting. Um, yeah, it's super lightweight too. Oh yeah. It's like so lightweight and small or whatever, but I thought it'd be kind of cute to kind of use with like houses like this or other like little scenery things, nativity you could even put it with. Um, yeah, because it snowed back then too, so that's cool. Um, but I thought it was cool. Anyway, it was super cheap and I liked it. It was very simple and it'll match a bunch of my stuff. So that's why I picked it up. So, okay, let's keep going. So this next item, I was actually really, really, really excited to find this. Basically, this is just from Wonder Shop again, and this was only 50% off. They actually marked it down with like a clearance tag, which I thought was actually kind of interesting. But basically, this was originally $26.99. 50% off makes it $13.48 half off. <laughs> so $13.48. Super excited to find this. Basically, this is just the uh, Wonder Shop Queen Flannel Sheet Set. So this is what it looks like. Super cute, super big. I love it. Um, but basically, it's just gray flannel sheets for your bed with white snowflakes. I love this. Um, my mom actually found sheets last year, and I don't remember. They were like white with like a bunch of words on them and things like that, and little Christmassy pictures. Um, and I didn't pick up any of that style because I just didn't really care for it. It just doesn't match my stuff. But this will definitely look cute with my bed and whatnot. Kind of mix in some pink with that and I have a uh, white comforter so this will match perfectly but I thought this was so cute and such a good deal for only $13.50 I have brand new sheets for winter time for only 13 bucks so I just took that like little thing off so you guys can get a better idea of what they look like I don't know I'm super excited I don't know does it come with um pillowcases I don't think so it's just probably Oh yeah, it does. Okay, it comes with one flat sheet, one fitted sheet, and two standard pillowcases. That's actually a really good deal for only $13.50. I'm obsessed. Then they just called this the gray snowflake. Again, Target, such a good deal. I love this print last year. I know that they actually had a couple when my mom picked hers up and I didn't really care for any of them. And I think the one that I did, they did not have in queen. So yes, I love it. My new queen winter sheets for only $13.50.
So these next two items I was so excited to find and I think my sister actually picks them up too but basically I only found these on 50% off so they were originally $12.99. I got them for $6.50 or $6.49 or $6.48 whatever it is. Um, I was really excited to find these and I found again one of each for myself and I think again my sister found one of each for herself too. So basically they're just from the brand Threshold and there are these two really cute glittery like word banners and so this one just says let it snow in silver glitter. So pretty. And then this one of course is my absolute favorite and this one is in gold glitter because duh <laughs> and this one actually says light mistletoe so i thought they were so cute again super affordable for only like 650 or whatever they were um since they were only half off of 12.99 so yes i was so excited to find these so cute um and i don't know yeah this one is five feet and this one is six feet long so that's actually really cool i love it super cute super cute um except glitter is literally falling everywhere out of these boxes so just fyi glitter will be falling out i might have to actually seal these in with just like some sealant spray i know people use like hairspray for these kinds of crafts but that honestly scares me because i don't know how it's going to turn out i at least know that sealant spray works the mod podge one is my tried and true go to <laughs> clear seal and spray so anyway yeah now i have glitter it's okay i love glitter but uh yeah so excited to find those again for only like 650 buy one get one free basically so okay we're getting down to the nitty-gritty we literally have three sets of items left i have some on my bed and then two over here um but yeah some super 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 good deals so okay let's just keep going okay so i lied i definitely have four sets of things but that's okay basically this next item was originally 34.99 we got this for 70% off which made it 10.49 I believe um and the reason I say we is because we don't really know who's going to take this basically we just did like one big purchase at Target and we we're just going to split it all up um and we have not decided who is actually going to take this quite yet we will definitely see um but basically this is the hearth and hand tree skirt and it is just the green plaid the green and black plaid print so beautiful I don't know is it showing up navy Maybe not. I don't know. But it's really, really beautiful. It's super nice. Again, it was only $10.50. So such a good deal. And yeah, it's just a basic tree skirt. The size of this is a... Um, it says it fits a tree diameter from 42 inches to 54 inch diameter tree skirt. 52 inches in diameter. Something like that. So um, yeah, I don't know. I thought it was just so beautiful. I was actually the one to find it. So I don't know. Maybe I get like a couple extra points in my favor for that. But again, it's just so beautiful. And my mom did just get a new tree skirt this year. But we will definitely see because as you guys know, I want to have like my, of course, girly pink stuff. And then I also want to have like my traditional stuff when I move and kind of have that as like my main like, I don't know. I always get these so confused living room and family room this is a huge debate in my family because to me a living room is where you live like that's where like you hang out the most like that's where you're currently living your life in and then the family room is where you go to when family comes over I mean to me that's like the best logic but I know it's like backwards so technically in my future family room I think I want to have like my traditional vintagey type items I just thought this was so pretty I have a lot of other tree skirts not gonna lie um but again we will definitely see who this goes to we're not quite sure yet so anyway I love it it was only 1050 such a good deal so okay now we have three items left in this video okay guys so this next item I'm going to try my absolute hardest to not laugh my way through this but basically I found three of these on clearance at Target. They were originally $19.99 each. We got them for 70% off, which made them $5.99. So I got one, my mom got one, and my sister got one. And what's actually really funny is that, <laughs> let me just show you what it looks like. Okay, so there are these really cute Christmas tree trays that are all white and gold. Super cute, right? Like this is a good size tray. So cute. I love it. I don't know. I wasn't super de duper in the market for anything like this, but it was really fun. Um, and I did just try to film this clip right before I'm talking because um, I had done a whole spiel about it and then I read on the back and it just kind of, anyway. <sighs> So you guys will see if you're watching my vlogmas footage that I still have yet to put up, but you will see in the footage that, okay, <laughs> let me just share with you. So on the back right here, it is just from the brand at Threshold. It says, not for food use, for decorative use only. We use this for food <laughs> at Bunko. We had like a cheese ball on here and crackers. So um, don't use it for food. Don't be dummies like us. We certainly use this for food. Okay, first and foremost, in our defense, this is a giant tray to use for decoration use only. Um, I was sitting here going, what would you put in here? Like a candle, like maybe some matches, 
like a snuffer. I don't, I honestly, <laughs> the fact that we are just now figuring out that these are for decorative use and not food, that changes the whole game. So I'm gonna have to come up with something super clever. I don't wanna put just like random loose ornament balls in here. Um, the whole candle thing, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get creative, maybe with some pine cones. Um, but yeah, this is not for food use, so the fact that we put a cheese ball on this is so funny to me. Um, yeah, just, just read the directions, folks. Not for food use, for decorative use only, so... Yeah, there's that. Basically, if you guys don't understand what I'm talking about, Bunko, um, I don't even know how much of this I talked about it in my actual Vlogmas footage, but Bunko got pushed back to January this year because of scheduling conflicts and also my sister got injured right before our trip to Disneyland. Basically, again, if you did not watch that video, I will make this as quick as I can, but literally hours before we were leaving for Disneyland, my sister did something really stupid. We were literally giving my grandparents their house keys and Kaylin like, my grandpa had made a joke. My sister had jumped up on, like, this, like, little dirt mound thing. And when I said, Kaylin, get down, she, like, lost her footage. Or lost her footing. Lost her footage. Lost her footing. Fell face first down their driveway. Busted her lip open, like, upper and lower on, like, the brick pavers that line their driveway. We ended up in emergency room. We were there for, like, three hours before our trip. It was crazy. It was chaos. It was all of the above. Um, where am I going with this? Oh, yes. Scheduling issues. So, not only that, but when we came back, everyone was busy we're like let's just push it push it till january so when we got these trays we were super excited we're like oh my gosh we could put like food on them like they're so cute um but they're not for food use so that's why our christmas bunko was in january it was just because it worked for everybody better so basically after we came back from disneyland that was the other thing i accidentally gave them the wrong dates that i was like oh yeah that weekend's perfect and then when i got home and we talked about it a couple days later my mom's like that's our disneyland trip and i was like oh my gosh so uh we wanted to have it i forget which weekend it was that we wanted to have it uh, but all the girls were busy and then of course it was like the week before Christmas or literally days before Christmas we weren't going to do that we wanted to do it on like the what was it like the 29th or something like that Friday before the end of the year that was too crazy for people so it got pushed to like January 5th that first Friday so anyway that's why you will see a cheese ball on this tray in that footage if you're going to be watching it because we thought it was a tray for food. So uh, yeah, we're gonna have to get super creative with this next year. Uh, but again, it was still such a good deal nonetheless. It was only $5.99 for a tray that was originally 20 bucks. So I'm not complaining so much so, but this will be fun to eventually decorate with. It could be a coffee on your coffee table, dining table, whatever you wanna do with it. But anyway, that is that. That was the quickest way I could explain that and um, kind of preface the fact that you're gonna see food on this <laughs> in my vlog this footage. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I've got two more things. Let's keep going. So these next items, I was so excited to find it. They had so many of these gosh darn pillows. So basically they were originally $24.99 on 70% off clearance. It made them $7.49, which again is an amazing deal. Literally two of them for $15. What? <laughs> this would have cost you 15 bucks or $50. I'm sorry, $50 and you got them for $15. That's amazing, does that make sense? Yeah, you would have paid $50 for the two of them, but instead we paid 15 for the two of them. That's an amazing deal. So anyway, they're just these really beautiful white, kind of creamy white sweatery pillows with these really fun kind of emerald green, large fluffy tassels on the ends of the pillow. So gosh darn adorable. I'm so obsessed with these. These are gonna look great with like my vintage kind of a traditional Christmas decor. I am so obsessed with these. Again, I picked up two, they had so many of these pillows. I'm not even kidding. There was an abundance of these. So I got two, my mom got two, Kaylin got two, again, for 15 bucks for the set of two, which is an amazing deal. So anyway, yeah, love these. Again, I really didn't delve too far into like the Christmas Target stuff before Christmas was going on. Like, of course I went shopping and I picked up some things, but I really didn't like search out like the hearth and hand stuff or like the other things that Target was carrying. So it was honestly kind of like a little like treasure adventure hunt <laughs> when I got to the like clearance stuff. Cause I honestly did not have really much of an idea of what to expect. It had been a while since I'd been in there. So again, I hadn't even seen these pillows. So I was super excited to find these. These were like a happy little find since I had not seen these or even like the bottle opener beforehand. The signs, I think I might've seen the banners, but for the most part, yeah, not even the tree skirt. So again, it was definitely like a little fun, happy little Easter egg hunt, I guess, during Christmas. So yeah, I don't know. I thought they were great. Super cute. Again, $7.50 each. Such a good deal for these really fun pillows and they are huge. So uh, yeah, such a good 
bang for your buck. <laughs> okay, I've got one more item left in this video and I'm so excited for it because it has got to be one of my favorite finds from the Target Christmas stuff. Anyway, yeah, it actually kind of has like a funny little story to it. Um, and I'm really excited. I might actually take it out of the box too in a minute because it's just kind of a banged up box. Okay, anyway, let's get into my last and final item for this video. So my last and final item from the Christmas Target clearance stuff. I was so excited to find this. Honestly, again, I did not see this before Christmas, or at least had forgotten it even existed. Um, but basically, as I was leaving Target, I decided to walk along one of the back aisles of like the aisles, like the back inside, does that make sense? Of like one of the aisles, and this was near the kitchen stuff, literally shoved in at the bottom of the shelf. I saw the corner of the box and I was like, what is that? That looks kind of kind of large. So I pulled it out and it was a Christmas wreath. Such a good deal. This was originally $24.99. So again, just like the pillows, this was 70% off. I paid $7.49 for this wreath. So expensive excited so cute I might take it out of the box because okay well let me let me just show you so this wreath is an 18 inch diameter wreath it is such a good size it is so beautiful and it, again it's from the threshold but this is just what the wreath looks like here is what the mangled box looks like um I don't know if it's like oh shoot it's like attached hold on let me see if I can ah oh, they're just like little twisty ties so um anyway I can kind of talk to you guys while I'm doing this but this was certainly like shady the musical because somebody was trying to hide this in the in the Christmas um uh, not Christmas oh my goodness someone was trying to hide this in the kitchen stuff and whoops it just fell out <laughs> oh my god there's gonna be glitter everywhere now that's okay it is so beautiful and now it has like these weird twist ties hanging off the back um, so yeah, I was like, felt like a little treasure hunter that day that I found it. Okay, so this is just what the wreath looks like. It's got like this weird little hanger thing. It's kind of like a faux suede-ish kind of material that's like tan and brown. And then this weird plastic little Christmas ball. I don't know. And then like, these were holding it to the box. So these of course come off. But Anyway, this is just what the wreath looks like. It's really awesome. It's all white. I don't know if it's showing up kind of cream at all. Not really quite sure. But basically, it is like a snowy, glittery wreath. And as you can see, like the close-up details, they're like kind of clear, kind of silvery, reflected um, little what would you call them? Like little sequins, little glittery sequins. But again, I'll probably end up taking this off to be honest, because this just doesn't match my stuff. And maybe add like a really fun ribbon or bow at the top. And then you could definitely add other things to this if you don't want to leave it just like that. But um, I don't really know what I'm going to quite do with this or what I'm going to do with this quite yet. Um, bows probably more so than whatever this is. But I love it. I thought it was such a good deal for only $7.50. So beautiful. Oh, I just love this. I wish you guys could like see the detailing. As you can see though, it does sparkle every little time I turn it or move it. It definitely glimmers. It's definitely shimmery. It's definitely all over the place now. But anyway, I love it. <laughs> These little tag things. This is what was holding it to the box. That is so funny. So uh, yeah, love this. Again, such a fun find. I don't know if they had any other like matching items to go with this, like maybe a garland. I don't know. I have literally no clue. But I was still really happy to find it because I can definitely think or I definitely think that I could like mix it in with like the rest of my decor and whatnot and Christmassy kind of girly type items. So anyway, I love that. So cute. Okay, guys. So that is all I have for this haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, it's been a while since I've actually sat down and filmed a haul video. So I feel a little rusty. I do apologize. But yeah, I've got a bunch of more videos <laughs> I need to film. I have so many videos. Not gonna lie. It's a little overwhelming. My life has really been changing so much since the new year started. So I think what I'm going to do is after I do kind of like my haul videos and maybe even some DIYs and stuff coming up coming up I'm definitely going to be doing my life update kind of video q and I really wanted to do this last year before the holiday season kicked in but of course the holidays literally came and went so fast so um yeah I think it is now time to actually do that since I did have you guys leave questions on one of my videos um that I'm going to go back and answer for a QA and a video but I think what I'm going to do is do like a two-parter like one that's like mostly just questions about like the moving process and how that's going and updates this that and the other um and then kind of doing like a generic q Q and a life update kind of a video just because so much is going on and if you guys don't follow me on Instagram or Twitter you definitely should um, just because I have been updating that with what is going on in my life right now so anyway yeah that's that and I've got so much planned for this year literally insane so 
Um, yeah, with that said, I have a bunch more videos I'm going to be filming, so definitely stay tuned. If you guys enjoyed this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. That way you'll be notified when I post more of these awesome videos. And if you guys want to follow me on any of my social media pages, I have Instagram, Twitter, <laughs> Twitter, and Snapchat, and I leave all my little handles right down here. As always, you guys know the drill. So anyway, with that said, I'm just looking at all this because now I have a mess to clean up. But um, that is all I have for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It is so nice to sit down and film a video. I know I'm probably talking like a mile a minute in this video but again it's been a little while and it's like i don't know like 11 30 at night so okay <laughs> that is that that is all i have thank you guys seriously so much for watching and i will see you all in my next video